Alrighty, last video of the day. And it is a good one right here. Um, if you don't know, in the channel description, there is a little bit talking about what sports I cover. And, well, the Premier Lacrosse League is one of those sports that I cover. <laughs> and it's been hard being a lacrosse fan. And, like, it, it's just been crazy. I, I Unlike college football or college basketball, I am not interested in college lacrosse. Not interested at all. Um, and the way it is is that I'm also not interested in the National Cross League, the Indoor Cross League. Uh, I'm not interested in that at all. Um, but I will tell you that I am interested in Major League Lacrosse um, and the Premier Lacrosse League. Um, now, the Premier Lacrosse League came into existence last year thanks to Paul Rabble um, and his guys, you know, um, and his brother and stuff like that. Uh, basically, they are a touring-based league, um, which, you know, has been very much... Um, you know, they have tested the waters, and they're coming back for their second season in 2020. Um, and it actually just got announced that they're the, um, the first couple of weeks um, for the season have just been announced um, as far as where they're going. Um, they're actually going up to Long Island for week three. Um, and I'm not sure what the other two... two um, not sure what the other two um, games are, um, but they'll be in Long Island for uh, week number three, and that'll be on June 12th, June 13th, so um, yeah, we're going to look ahead and um, see and look in here, you know, because I believe the rest of the... Um, The other um, arenas have been, you know, announced as far as, you know, um, yeah, Atlanta, June 6th through 7th, and, you know, um, the first place they're going to, which is, um, I don't remember exactly, um, but I'm looking at the PLL Twitter right now, um, and we'll, 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 we'll look here, and we'll... Um, see if I can find it. Hold on, just give me a moment. Just give me a moment. Um, it's a little, it's a little hard to find it you know, on these tweets and stuff like that. Um. I don't know where they're going for week one, but, you know. <sighs> oh. I'm sorry, y'all. Just give me a moment. Let me find it, because immediately it was... It was absolutely, you know, here, um, and it should be somewhere. Should be able to find it. This is taking a little bit longer than I think it needs to be. Yeah, going to Long Island for week three, going to um, Atlanta for week two, and I'm trying to find the date for week number one. Um, somewhere and um, yeah um, hold on oh it's Boston they're going to Boston I, I, I'm not I'm not good with my memory and stuff so Boston week one um, Atlanta week two and um, Long Island, which has just been announced today, week three. And, you know, it's, it's, it's all good stuff, man. Let me tell you, um, 
it's all good and stuff like that for the PL to be doing this. Um, and the major league and major league will losses in a um, it's in a bit of a bind right now. Um, to be completely honest with you, um, there's six teams left in that league, and most of them are either like I don't know what's going on or something else. Um, you know, now that the now that Major League Lacrosse is just like okay, we're gonna be, we're gonna do the single entity thing which the AFL did, and it did not go too well. Um, but yeah, the P the the MLL is just like I don't know what's happening at this point, and I have not watched that league in so long. Um, and I got into the Premier Lacrosse League a little bit too late last year, um, so and I was initially skeptical. Of the, the PLL, but it ended up being it ended up being a good product. Like it's been a while since I've watched a lacrosse game. But there's also one more thing aside from that. The the Premier Lacrosse League had six teams last year. Now they have seven. The seventh team is the Water Dogs, and I did not have a team last year. I am going to have one this year, and I am going to watch every Water Dogs game. I am a water dog stand. So, yeah, the, yeah, the name of the water dog sounds a little bit stupid. And, the, of course, the expansion draft is um, sometime, I believe, like February, March, or April, or something like that. One of the months. Um, the season begins, like, May, May 29th through May 30th. And it's going to be a fun time, man. It's going to be a fun time. It'll be at the end of the college season. So, you know, that's going to be great. Um... But, yeah, the PLL is riding high on the momentum that they had last year, and it's going to be fun. You know, all they need, all the, all they need is just an arena, like, basically each and every week. And we'll, we'll talk about the other arenas as time gets a little bit closer to um, May and stuff like that. Um, I don't want to make a video for every single, single week talking about, you know, like, hey, this is where the PLL is going this week. Um, that's a little bit too repetitive, to be completely honest. Um, because we have other things on this channel that we need to discuss. As far as, you know, NBA and college basketball goes but right now. And the Super Bowl right now. Things like that, you know. Um, but, yeah, and, of course, the indoor football as well, which is coming up in March. And the XFL, which is coming up in the week after the Super Bowl. Um, but, yeah. PLL is doing fantastic. I am loving every second of this league right now. It is doing things. It is actually engaging with the fans. Um, and the fans love it. I love this league. Um, I hope it sticks around for a long time. And I hope this style of touring base leagues like the Big Three or the PLL continue um, to, you know, be a thing because this is this stuff this kind of thing is just nice um and it's so great uh obviously i'm not gonna be able to travel up to boston or long island or atlanta or something like that but i'm gonna be able to watch the games on nbc because that free deal exclusive deal with nbc um i'm not sure about um as far as water dogs games goes i know there's gonna be some games that might be behind the NBC Sports Gold paywall, which is sucky, um, but you know it is what it is. Um, but yeah, the Premier Lacrosse League. I thank you guys. Have a great going on here, and I'm loving every second of it. So yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. That's gonna do it for today. That's gonna do it for basically um, the week until about Friday. So you'll see me back here on this um on your screens and you know your youtube screens and stuff like that on friday we'll be talking about college basketball and nba um so yeah you know we're heading on out and we'll see you guys friday um for you know the nba and then and, and college basketball saturday preview because it's gonna be fun to talk about that y'all take care